Hello, hi. I hate you. Hello, hi. Welcome to the event part of this. Uh, mini games and stuff. Uh, currently there's two out. One more is gonna be in two more days, I believe. So yeah. Hi, when when she. Oh, is his voice? No. Okay. Round and fluffy, soft and bouncy, jump and bump. Yo, can I have that table? Oh my, yes, welcome, welcome, and allow me, Wen, Wen Shun, to be a first to wish the two of you joyous lantern ride. Happy lantern night, Miss Wen Yun. Wen Jun. Do you always look like this? I don't remember. You seem to be reciting something just now. What were you talking about to yourself? Is it a, a delectable dessert or perhaps a revolutionary recipe? Uh, not far off the mark. Nearly hole in one. I was just thinking about the food Goba and Yui Gui are gonna make. Huh? Now those names we know, you know Goba and Yui Gui too? <laughs> How could I not? They're looking at one of one main restaurant's regulars, you know? As long as I'm not on the road, I eat at least seven meals a week at one main restaurant. When paired with my hometown style of cooking, First some lightly seasoned fare, then a spicy flavor bomb. It's just a smash it. If I end up with too much heatiness, it just need down to down some of the right mess and flush it right out. And then after a couple of days, we soup recuperating, it's back to gorging myself in Chow Town. That sounds amazing. Best take it easy. Paimon wants some too. Anyway, I get to see Goba and Xiang Ling pretty much every week, and sometimes even little Yao Yao. When Yao Yao brings Yue Gui along to see Xiang Ling, Guobo and Yue Gui end up playing together. Ah, it's wonderful. No matter how exhausting work is, just watching them shake and sway is enough to sweep all your cares away. But I can't be the only one being cured by Guobo and Yue Gui. I want everyone to bear witness their cuteness for themselves. Well said. Now this is something important, but just how do you plan to do it? Unless these things on the table are... Bingo! I just made a paper theater featuring Goba and Yue Gui as the stars. Everything you see here in this store is a prop for the paper theater. Paper theater? That name kinda sounds familiar, doesn't it? Is it the box canvas behind you and watching the shadow on it? Mm -hmm. You guys have heard of Paper Plays, a traditional leeway art form. By artfully using the pictures and lights, you can make the scene on the screen come to life. I love Paper Plays since I was a kid, and learned a bit more about them from Master Ying Gong. After I grew up, I became a painter, painter studying and traveling all over the world. While I was in Fontaine, I, wow, I learned a few new drawings techniques. And a thing or two about filming, I had quite a few spark of inspiration too. So using paper play as a basis, I tried creating a novel interactive game and thus the paper theater you see before you was born. Paper theaters and paper plays are also very different style. Paper theaters focus on simple short story that will bring a smile to the audience. So that's why this year's paper theater uh, will be all about this especially amiable story Wobo and Yue Gui looking for ingredients to cook up something delicious together Wobo and Yue Gui cooking together? That sounds really interesting Food and fun in one place? Now that's proof of paying attention to <laughs> Looks like you two are totally on board The excitement is inspiring There's no time to lose Please, just relax and get ready to enjoy this paper theater performance. Dialogue lady. Holy shit. Uh huh. It can be used three times. What? Which move? Starting cut of box. Let's stay with the coffin. 
Oh, we call. Okay, so that's like a redo, I guess. When you say Fontaine, man, your hair actually look like Fontaine. Actually, this is nice look. Were you before in the previous Lantern White? I'm not sure, but I like her design a lot. Reminds me of Elizabeth from Bioshock. Oh well. Welcome customer, ready to enjoy another paper theater performance? About the dish to be made. You put in some work, I won't bother you then. Uh, okay. Oh ho, so you did notice. Jiu Yun chilies are indeed not among the ingredients they are gathered in this paper plate field. That's because the dish they are making is 8 treasured duck. A real classic that. And not all that spicy. My family is used to food with lighter seasoning. Maybe something a bit saltier if we are feeling adventurous, but not fans of spice. I don't think a person would just stick to the food they like as a child. Everyone would should gradually expand their culinary horizon, find their own taste and learn about learn to appreciate all kinds of deliciousness. It's a big big world out there filled with so many mouth watering meals. It's good to switch things up, even if there's no good reason. Going for something blander first and then something spicier and then can really spike up your taste bud. So even if, as I promote the cuteness of Goba and Weigui, I also recommending this 8 treasure duck. I'll have you know that, you, that it goes well with all kinds of dish. Reading. Okay, let's play. Oh, more like watch. Okay. Mushrooms. Oh. Use the leg stick to consume stuff. Whatever. Mm. Oh, they did say that, didn't they? Go uh. back, got a mushroom. Yippee! Uh, go back, then. Air pasture will be marked. Will be deemed unaccessible within the path. Okay. Touch the key release to cancel from the lock. You cannot reach the key. Try to push the box or other methods. This is cute. Okay. Oops. <laughs> That's so cute. <laughs> <laughs> What does Goba want to like? Ah. Wow. Oh. Whoa. Oh. We double player now? Shit, son. I want to go here because I can. Well, shit. With that, that's the wrong thing. Oh. Not push this thing. No. I'm being stupid. Wait. Go here. Push that. Okay. Go. Whoops, too much. Yay. Next stage. Oh my goodness. What is this? Here you go. Can I get the raid key or do I need UA Gray to do that for me? No. Too early. Okay. Okay. Ah, and then go bar will push it down. And then free that one so that he can do this. Do this to this. 
Okay, go up. And then go back down. Yes. Okay, cool. Oh my god. I think it should be way great first. Do I need to push the key to the key? Oh dear. I think I should. Stay there, buddy. Hmm. No. Yes. No. Wait, go. Uh, I feel like I'm supposed to push that one out. Yeah, okay. Go. Cool. Maybe I need to push it more. I can't make it. Uh, uh, what is maybe I should push that box up away? Okay, wait, wait, wait. I'm coming, buddy. You are free now. Oh, yay, got it. Wait, did I need the key? Yo! Oh, you can push the card. Push. Okay, go. You way great. Push me. <laughs> okay. One, two, one. Go up. Go there. Go bar. Get them. Okay. Yippee! Chicken. Next stage. Oh dear God! What is this? Uh, let's go way, way. I think I need to push it up. Can you push it from inside? Oh, you can. Nice. Go. Cool. Oh, nice. Go. Cool. Can I move the cart down? Oh, you can. Nice. I wasn't expecting it to go down, I guess. Interesting. Okay, I think it's the last one. Uh, let's see. I think I need to move away, go away. Okay, okay, and go down. What the? Oh, okay, cool. Okay. Can I? I feel like I fucked up there. Yeah, I think. Mm. <laughs> Did I? I'm so confused now. Oh, was Goba supposed to push it down? My bad. Okay, wait. There we go. Oh, maybe push one more. Okay. 
um one two three four okay so we got a clearance there i think you need to push you one more no i can't okay wait boba can you push me back okay go your way way and then you get the key cool Oh, I'm blocking you. My bad. I I think I figured it out. Cool. Okay, and then wait, wait, go here, and then go bar. Nice. Ooh, you made up food. Interesting. I'm guessing the reward was a food, I guess. Wait, let me check. Oh, we actually got one. Nice. Eight treasure dog. Oh. Nice. Oh, esteemed guest. I, the apprentice, apprentice storyteller Juanju, must humbly request you cease your step for a moment. Perhaps you have heard a tale that goes something like this. In a beautiful night of lantern light, flaming light once danced across the sky like glowing bushes. Bushes. Like a majestic scroll. Uh, Paimon didn't catch that. Flaming lights? Painting the sky? That's not something ordinary people can do. Even if you have some kind of airship, there's some kind of mysterious paint that can hang in the air just like that. Sounds like a serious exaggerated analogy. Are you talking about fireworks? Anyway, the protagonists of this tale are <laughs> none other than you two. The renowned Aoi whose fame has spread throughout the land and her companion, Paimon. Huh? Perhaps you already forgotten, but this time last year, you accepted a commission from the adventurer Tian Tian, Tian Tian and participated in a special speed one challenge. That speed one challenge was eliminated by the glow of fireworks. And most inside most majestic and splendid scene of what not often some that often threw me off guard. Now that you mention it, Paimon remembers that we have helped some promoter from the guild. It was nothing really. She said she wanted to say use use the event to recruit new members. No idea it actually worked though. I'm guessing something like that might have happened. At the time, I was drowning my soul in liquor near the Wongshun Inn, and as I looked up, I saw your silhouette framed by the fireworks. In a moment, the sadness from fluke flunking the exam, my confusion about the path that lay in before me, it was all dispelled in a flash by your radiant figures blazing bright with vitality. So I put myself together and continued my research into folk tales, and thus came to Chunyun Vale, drinking deep of my favorite subject. I must thank you for the encouragement for you gave me. <laughs> it is not just me. Many were moved by your splendid silhouette, joining the adventurous guild and finding new direction in life. Um, Paimon never imagined anything like that. We didn't even notice anyone watching at the time. And they didn't even think of us joining a in a little race could inspire other people. When you put it like that, it's kind of embarrassing. It's good to see the spirit having improved. Congratulations! To run into it today is a good fortune. There is one thing I will ask you. In addition to expressing my sincerest gratitude, gratitude, please pass your radiant glory onwards and continue to inspire even more people. So, aren't we nearly as great as you say? We've got a good idea going. If you can cheer people up, we are in. Though now that you mention it, what do we do? In accordance to the usual practice, I use Tian Tian Racing Challenge as a reference and team up with other adventurers. Inspired by you, we have planned a brand new activity, Cloud Striding. There are many wondrous things in Chunyun Vale, including a strange cup that, whose power allows you to travel most swiftly, swiftly. All you need to do is walk over the valleys and mount the mountainian mountain stops of the nimbleness. <laughs> Showing your vibrant dynamism and all the sundry. Just as before. Okay, we are in. 
Of course, beyond and more, I have prepared a token of appreciation. We have prepared a variety of rewards too. Such paltry gestures pale to the hope that you have gifted so many with the excitement your past did desire. Inspire. But that is not all. In the future, you will find more chances to repay you. You're too kind. We will keep journeying on and helping others along the way. Even without a new reward. But after hearing you, we are even more inspired to keep on inventory. Let's do this thing. God, dialogue. Oh god, quest. Game. Oh, honorably traveler. What can I do for you? Can you tell me about yourself? About me? My experience? It's really quite ordinary. I just researched for folktales. No special abilities. When my research was at a standstill, I thought I was changing, about to change profession. So I registered for the Ministry of Civil Affairs exam. I ended up flunking. However, after being inspired by you, I clenched my teeth, overcome the difficulties posed by both the lack of funds and my own cognitive limitation, and found that there really wasn't any need for me to change my vocation in the first place. After I came to the wharf, I discovered that there's countless research topics, so I've been studying all kinds of folk that while I was work as a storyteller apprentice every single day, so fulfilling. And it's all because of you. Once again, thank you. Ow. <laughs> nice try this thing. Oh, this is a dialogue. I'm gonna skip that. Where am I supposed to go? Oh. Yo, time to start the quest. Oh, reach the destination. Ominous lanterns zooming, you have points deducted. If you get a firework, they will explode and pick up effects all over the object within the radius. How big is the radius then? Okay, interesting. So that is buff. Do we have any choice in the buff or it's just a longer way? I'm guessing it's a longer way. Hi, can we start? Whoopee! Oh, there's a timer. What? Eh. Whoa. A little too quick. Did I get anything? No, 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 no. Come back. Wait, wait, wait. Where am I going? There? Oh fuck! I like the music though. The music had a Chinese song going on right now. Eh. Oh! Wait, is that good? Oh, it is! Okay, cool! <laughs> Select stage. I said we got a choice in this. You have to go there anyway. Oh, thank god, it's like nowhere near. Whoa. Okay, that's like. Like, I think. What? Why is it so far? Oh, it's changing. Okay, that's interesting. It says it's perfect, so I'm assuming it's perfect. Are you gonna change? Oh no. No? Oh! I think I fucked up there. Oh well, GG. As long as I can get this one. It doesn't matter to me though.
We speed running, boys. Oh, one more. Picking up special move fireworks for the... Okay. Oh, double points. Interesting. If you hit a fire, I guess. Nicely done. Wapadu. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Speed running. One, speed one, let's go, let's go. Pop. Did I get it? I have no idea. Probably not. Wow, there's a lag. They get it? Go. Oh. Sometimes controller aim is a little scary sometimes, you know that? Did I get it? I don't know. Boop, 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 boop. Yippee! Not bad. Why is this one so off, man? Oh god, controllers. Please, can you stop making game like this? <laughs> I swear if I miss that, bro. I don't think that will work well, to be honest. <laughs> ah. Who? He? Wait, what? Were we just here before? Bruh. Why would they want not the last? This one should have the last one then. Happy Lantern, right? Do that? What? See, you two wouldn't be happen to be a big shot who came looking for Garmin, would you? We saw you before. You were hanging out with Garmin, right? Totally. Hot diggity, you remember me. My luck is on fire. I heard you two are the best of the best. There's ain't nothing you can do. I pop on over to Chihu who go out to buy groceries every day and even though you is so close by i still always hear people singing your praises along the way that's right we're the cream of the crop paimon is the best at eating and nothing she can't swallow <laughs> sure hey paimon is good at stuff besides eating too anyway wait let me that paimon thing for a moment what else was she good at <laughs> i've got it can ordinary people float just so white and light and fluffy. 
like a pigeon a depth okay buddy <laughs> flying alone is amazing i mean it should be super easy to carry stuff and it makes work a cinch you should help your fan more gaps what did i think oh my god your pigeon adapter spymon here comes spymon another strange nickname <laughs> just ignore whether it's possible for pigeon to, to to turn into adapters for now but i just want to point out she's always helping aoi for example if aoi falls from a really high place paimon will grab onto her and make sure she fall isn't too painful even though paimon is not strong enough to actually do much lifting if paimon really was a pet pigeon adapters she will give aoi a boost while using the glider to help her fly higher and farther you two gotta practice more then just like when I would practice wushu with Garming. The more you practice, the better you will work together. Report in easy to build. It is it just so happens I created a fast new game. Hot off the fest. It's called Just Wushu Dance. Wanna have a go? Not only can you work as a team, but you can learn about wushu dancing too. Just wushu dance? You wouldn't happen to be talking about a big old doll next to you, right? Bingo! Authentic wushu dance is downright cleverish to learn. Even if you got a pro swing showing you the ropes, you won't be able to stick with the, uh, stick with it unless you loved it and have to got the preserve preserve to match. <laughs> so I changed the rule to one style of wushu dance, switch out to some props, and boom, the game was born. Also, it's also lenta right now, so yeah. Perfect time for helping everyone join yourself <laughs> and work up an appetite on a walk of extra calories. Just put your dancing shoes. Well, dancing show off it and see who will grab the most tea bricks. You can dance and bump all over the shop. It's hood and half. It sounds like fun. But one thing doesn't think she's strong enough to wear such a big outfit and players. But I always pretty good at games like this. Paimon will watch and learn from the sideline. Bring it on, I am the dancing queen. Ha, huh, pigeon adapters. We will not personally participate, a PD. Ah, uh, it's not a problem. Aoi and Paimon will be traveling together for a long time to come. We have plenty of chances to level up our teamwork. Also, who is to say Paimon won't learn a bunch about working with Aoi just from watching? <laughs> you two are so close. I'm starting to get a bit jelly. Then please, right this way, let the do that of legendary deeds step right up. Just wushu dance, pigeon adapt this, and you just sit back and enjoy the show. I'm surprised she didn't clap back at him. Okay. Oh. Anything? Story, do that of the legendary deeds. You're positively glowing. Looks like you're raring to go. Ready for the dance? About the props. Not bad, eh? All the mods were made by yours truly. I added several kinds of special talcum powders to the dance suit, and it all mixes together when you pull the rope. The mixture released a bunch of gas, which helps the outfit suddenly stiffen, solid as rock, and proud as a lion. So, no matter how much you jump and dance and bump and fans, you won't get hurt. None. You won't get hurt none. Okay, fun and safety, all in one. Te the technique has been used on ships for a long time now, you know? Sailors used it to protect cargo. No matter how the wave toss and around the boxes and stuff inside won't go get smashed to smithereens. Anyway, as for the venue, I invented it from the shop. Big old empty basement like that, just sitting there unused and wasted. Well, it's sure being put to good use now. The boss of this shop is pretty dope too. Me promoting the wushu dance game helped bring business. So he didn't ask for much when. Depending on how things go, maybe I will be able to get Garmin over to put on a real show here. Interesting. I'm surprised he's like, do that bro. Okay, clear the photon. I see. Okay. Is that oh that's like two thousand? Oh man, what the hell? 
It's just a co-op game, bro. Unless he misclicks, then yeah, okay, fair. Good things come in rolling. Oh, you just Zenyan. Well. JP dude, Korean dude, I believe, and Korea. Whoa. Ow! Oh, thanks. How do you? <laughs> wow. Who's the highest? Ow! Target, bro. Ah, wow, dude, you went in. Cool AF, man. Was that revenge or something, bro? Hit a bigger number, guy, man. Who hit me? It was like nobody there. Oh, can I ram it? Who hit me there? There was nobody there. What? Gaming. Gaming. Fuck you. Who's that? Oh. Yeah, not fun anymore. How do I get out of it? What? Interesting. Hi, the evil guy is very aggressive. Hi, you see. Oh, what? Yo, I was very neck to neck with that guy. One thousand, not bad. Twenty, eighty, one forty. Whoa, fight! Ah, uh, light. Why? Rock on and have fun, really. Reach to the top. Interesting. Oh, there's like one time play. Interesting. I did not read. How many people rejected there? Okay. Oh, too bad. So use the passing circle to like confirm. Mm <laughs> hey! <laughs> Whoa, you teleporting piece of shit! Oh! <laughs> Laggy though! Is it me that's lagging or is it him? Somebody died. Hey, be nice, be nice, be nice. <laughs> be nice. Proceed to push him off too. Is there a difference between this two? Ow! Ow! Are you? Is that mine?
<laughs> Big man. Hi, don't kill me. <laughs> oh, do that do blue. <laughs> I can have it, I don't want it. Hmm. Hi. Uh... Ow. Damn, dude. <laughs> Maintain highest valor? Nice. <laughs> Lost due to danger zone. 40. Ooh, damn, dude. Unlucky. Unlucky, we were lucky. The pluck of good fortune. Okay. Oh, this is health? What? Okay. Interesting. Just need to clear this one and then I'm good to go. Oh. oh man, they're in my wall. Hazel. Okay, yeah. Interesting. Good luck, have fun, guys. Though I don't know what to do, to be honest with you. So, where am I at? Oh, I'm there. I have 100 HP. Huh? Interesting. What? Get out of the way. Oh, thanks. Really? What did I do to you, man? Oh, well, GG. Oh, well, three points, I guess. Man, you guys are quick. <laughs> eh. I didn't do anything, okay? You guys were fighting yourself. Oh shit. Why? Buddy! Fuck you, man. So aggressive. You can go there, fuck it. It's like somebody with the lowest point, I'm not last, so. so. <laughs> Damn, dude, that guy's. The Yemiko is so aggressive. Fushu God, Fushou. Like he was hyper aggressive. Looks like I can finally start this one. So yeah, ah, yo, fight Han. Really? Okay, thank God. <laughs> I need one K points. That's rough. Can I switch? I want to switch to coming. Oop. The lion dance above. This one again? I'm distracted. Oh fuck.
Lol? I'm like, what are you guys? I didn't push you. Okay, come down. Man, I'm gonna stay here because everything is too far. There we go. Oh shit. Nothing here, really. <laughs> and who got four four? Eh? Oh, you you just gonna say four four? Yeah, hey, I'm gonna say do. I'm gonna stay two. Oh, I missed like two. <laughs> Damn, I was about to follow him, and I forgot that I was outside of game. Damn it! Are you me, huh? Well, one two oh, it's not bad. Whoa, what is all those unique names? Sheesh, man. Yes, sir. I'm... Mm -hmm. Oh, is the point on it? Do I go hyper aggressive? Then I should. Is everybody awake? I figured that much. Why are all of you going to one box? Like why? There's like 10 million things. Oh, you guys can fight each other, I guess. Ooh, thanks. How do you get to me? What? Okay. Oop. It was so quick. Thanks for weeding them out, boy. Oh my god. How do you get so high, actually? Dude, those two flew. I'm I'm peace. <laughs> what? Bo wasn't even moving in my screen anyway. How did he not fly back, man? Dude! How did that one hit me? Stop sneezing, bro! Wow, how the heck do you get 4k? 400? That's a lie and a half. My ping must be that bad, huh? I need like 800 To be honest, I like the HP one That one is fun Fun? What the heck is that, man? 
Oh, this one. Okay. I want to switch to Zhao actually. It's been a while. Where's my boy? Zhao? Wow, you're pretty old, huh? Skin? You there, buddy? You lagging, buddy? I wouldn't be surprised. Oh, another Zhong Li. So we have grandma, grandpa, and a very confused son. One more leeway character? Are you? Okay. The ultra lost grandkid. <laughs> I have no idea what I just said. Go easy on me. Oh, well, I'm nowhere close. I mean, you're zooming, Grandma. How do you not hit? Oh, there's somebody else. I mean, somebody's a freaking race car, though. Can I zoom that quick or something? Is that a thing? I'm the lowest one. Can you let my can you can you give me can you can you can you can you let me win grandpa? Ow Did that hit me? I wasn't even close to you, buddy. Oh, I miss, I misjudged that. Not the ultra lost kid. No, come on. <laughs> Samiko I got my 6k I'm done <laughs> Well, that's the end of the mini games portion I guess I don't know But uh See you next year See you next week God knows man But hey See you next year in London right Okay buddies Also, happy Lunar New Year Okay I'm tired. If that mumbles, I'm sorry. <laughs> but yeah. See you next time. Bye. <laughs>